think we're going. All right. We're on the start of a quick little weekend trip here. Heading up to coast in Northern California near like Crescent City. So there's a free campground about half a mile, or half an hour from uh, from the coast, from Crescent City. So I'm gonna check that out. See if we can't get a spot. It's a Saturday, the middle of July, so I don't know how busy it's gonna be. And another thing with those free campgrounds is uh, you gotta watch out for tweakers. <laughs> that kind of attracts the wrong crowds sometimes. But uh, but free is better than uh, paying for hotels or or. Uh, paying for campgrounds so we'll see how it goes hey Ahsoka but right now it's it's a pretty nice drive highway 96 runs along the Klamath River some beautiful scenery uh, really nice road not too much traffic so all in all pretty nice start to the, to the weekend trip What do you think, Ahsoka? You gonna get in? But the water's nice, I kinda wanna get in. It's about 95 degrees out right now, and that water looks really nice, but I don't wanna sit in my car for the next three hours with wet shorts on. It's about a 150 mile drive for me. Should be about three hours or so. Uh, I'm hoping to get there before dark so I can set up my camp my tent. Just gonna camp next to the car. Um, so yeah, should be a nice weekend. Quick pit stop here, letting Ahsoka eat some dinner. You're hungry, it's about six o'clock. Pretty, pretty scenic spot, but a uh, big fire came through here a few years ago and everything's burnt up. Ground and uh, see if we can find a spot.
campground here. I'm just uh, interested to see how busy it is. I guess we will find out. I'm just nervous it's going to be full of tweakers. Moment of truth. Let's see what we got here. Right. Busy though. cars and none of them look like they're um, sketchy so let's give it a try. Well, we did it, made it to camp, got a nice little spot here, we're on the beach, next to the river, and far enough away from other people that we don't have to worry about a silk running off on them. So yeah, just in time too, right before dark, got everything set up. Take a little walk down here before it gets too dark. The soap is probably full of energy. Just been sitting in the car all day, being patient. So let's try to wear her out a little bit and then uh, drink some beers, call in night, and head to the coast tomorrow. It's about a half hour drive to the coast. Crescent City. I think I'm gonna go down uh, Highway 1, around Scenic Drive, so should be a good day. Got lovely nature, lovely scenery, and uh, people's trash. Dirty diaper. <laughs> but uh, if you can make your way around the trash, it's actually pretty nice. Tonight's menu, we've got a uh, Stormbreaker Brewing, old Mississippi Red, Dry Hopped Red Ale. Not bad, I have to say, not bad.
Well, made it to the ocean. Still a little foggy this morning though. It's supposed to get sunny this afternoon, so hopefully it clears up. But uh, yeah, pretty cool out here. Got the ocean, beach, and uh, Highway 101 is just right there. We're gonna head down to uh, we're gonna head down to um, what is it called? This like a, a dog friendly beach with a trail on it, I think. So check that out. What the hell is this? Sea foam. Seaweed covered with sea foam. <laughs> what are you doing, Ahsoka? What are you doing? <laughs> to go to uh, Gold Bluff Beach on the coast failed apparently uh, you need a day pass and some sort of permit and um, I don't know it's kind of dumb that's, that's, that's the problem it. with uh, a lot of these areas along the coast in Northern California it's all either state ground where they don't allow dogs or uh, it's something you need a permit for or if you got to register months in advance to get a campsite and it's i don't know it's kind of a hassle if you if you like spending money on just random things then yeah it's good you can buy a campground and buy a permit and buy a day pass but uh if you if you like just uh kind of freestyling and just kind of going where the road takes you it's not great it's beautiful it's scenic but uh really tough to find a find a, something to do without having to pay and with having a dog so I don't know 
I guess we'll just drive around. I'm gonna drive down south towards uh, Eureka, California, and maybe just make a couple more pit stops, but there's not really much else I can do up here. I mean, there's plenty of people, um, trails, every single trail um, doesn't allow dogs, not even on leash, uh, so it's just, not the best but uh i don't know we'll, we'll make the best of it we'll say that so it's okay well we found a beach that uh is somewhat dog friendly but here's where they send you they send you to the deadly steep beach five people have drowned at this beach if you if you want to go to the beach with a dog you're gonna risk drowning. That's just that's just what you gotta do. Um, and on leash only. Like who who has a leash for their dog on like on a beach? Look at all this. Look at all this ground. You can run around. I like to put a dog on a leash. All right, I'm risking my life for the sake of my dog. This is a great state of California. Apparently they hate dogs. Well, let's hope I don't die here. made it down the lovely deadly steep beach without dying uh, so that is a feat in its own but not a whole lot to do here at deadly beach goodbye deadly steep beach Now this is more like it. No permits, no fees, no people. Just blue skies, clear water. This is where it's at. Look at this oh gosh, she's swimming. She's swimming. Where did she go? Don't go too far. Don't go too far. She's just taken by the current. There you go. Good job. Good job, girl. You did it. She did it. This is her first time swimming. Look at her go. So, all in all, I'd say the coast is scenic. It's pretty. Uh, but, I don't know. I wouldn't recommend it unless you want to spend money and uh i don't know sit in traffic but this is where i like all right good
job, Soka. Good job. Where are you going? Where are you going? Yeah, yeah. look at you go. Look at you go. <sighs> Look at you go. You're swimming. Too far. <laughs> Hold on, guys. My rescue dog. <laughs> so that's it. So that's it. What do you think, Soka? Yeah, you did it, you swam. Signing off.